Hi everyone, welcome to Live Blogger. In this video, I will explain to you the difference between queries and keywords in digital marketing. So let's get started. Digital marketing has many different terminologies. Using the wrong word for something can cause confusion. So it is important to know the meaning of some of the important terms used in digital marketing. In the same way, there are some terms that are often used interchangeably by beginner digital marketers. Queries and keywords are two different terms in digital marketing, which has different meanings. Knowing what is the meaning of each word is important for a digital marketer. The website visitor doesn't need to know anything about what is a query or what is a keyword. He just wants to search for something and get the most relevant search results as possible. But a digital marketer should be able to know these things which will help him to be able to create or manage his online campaign. So let's take a look at the differences between queries and keywords. First of all, let's see what actually is a query. Query also can be called search query or search term. So a query is a term or a set of words that a user types in a search engine when he wants to search for something. For example, if a user wants to buy a smartphone, he may type search queries like best smartphones, which smartphone has the best camera, buy a new smartphone, which is the best smartphone, etc. These are just a few examples. In fact, there are so many different ways in which a visitor searches for things. Along with these, there may also be a lot of users typing spelling mistakes when doing the search. These all are included in the search query. Now if we talk about keywords, they are basically phrases used to target the visitor that searches for something. So if the visitor searches for the queries that we discussed earlier, like buy a new smartphone, then the keyword that is targeted for such a visitor is smartphone. So whenever the visitor searches for that query, the ads which are set with the keyword smartphone will get displayed to the visitor. Queries are used by visitors to browse around the internet searching for something. Keywords are basically used by companies to target a specific type of audience. A keyword is chosen strategically by the company or a digital marketer so that the person who sees the ads has a high probability of purchasing their service. Keywords are also used by website owners who want to do some SEO that is search engine optimization. When a blogger writes an article, he sprinkles in the keyword that he has in the article a reasonable number of times. This helps search engines like Google to know what the article is all about. The common visitors don't have an idea of what a query or a keyword is. They just visit a search engine, type for something and expect the search engines to deliver them the results. And Google does an exceptionally good job at that. On the other hand, the digital marketers are well aware of these terms. They try to choose the best possible keyword they can for a particular product they have. It helps them to display their ads to the right audience and it also helps the visitors to get what they are searching for. Digital marketers make use of various tools that can help them search for keywords that can be extremely beneficial for them in showing the results to the visitor. One of such tools is called Keyword Planner from Google. There are many other tools as well that can help you achieve this. The digital marketer can also go to Google and type in the keyword that they are targeting and then from the search query suggestions that Google shows, he can have an idea of what are the queries that a typical visitor has for a particular keyword. Whenever a visitor types for something, search engines like Google may sometimes change the search query slightly. Some words in the search query may be excluded by the algorithm just to make sure that the results may not be manipulated by some unimportant word. Then the algorithm processes the search term and decides on which websites to show where. And in this way you get the results in Google. So if you are a digital marketer or a website owner or a blogger, then the term that is important for you is keyword. Alright, so that's basically it for this video. 
I hope that now you have an understanding of what is a query and a keyword and uh, what are the differences. So if you have any doubts you can ask in the comments below and uh, click on the like button if you found this useful and also subscribe to this channel to get the latest video updates. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day.